Welcome to today's edition of the show podcast. Kabir Beatty's son Siddharth Beatty had died of suicide in 1997, and it was also reported that he was schizophrenic. Kabir Beatty has been making a lot of buzz these days courtesy his upcoming autobiography, Stories I Must Tell. The Emotional Journey of an Actor The senior actor has opened up on several aspects of his life, from his journey in showbiz to his marriages, relationship with Purveen Bobby and much more. And while Kabir is set to launch his book soon, he has also opened up about his son Siddharth's suicide lately and how it had affected the entire family. Speaking to Bollywood Hungama about it, Kabir said that while his son was diagnosed with schizophrenia, they weren't aware of it initially and struggled to battle the unknown ghosts. He also recalled how Siddharth had a violent breakdown on Montreal streets and was controlled by as many as eight policemen. Siddharth was a very brilliant young man. He was exceptional in his abilities and then suddenly, one day, he couldn't think. We tried so hard to first figure out what was wrong, and for three years, we battled these unknown ghosts, and eventually, he had this extremely violent breakout in the streets of Montreal, and it took eight policemen to nail him down. And then, the doctors in Montreal finally diagnosed him as schizophrenic, Kabir had told Bollywood Hungama. He also mentioned that while the entire family tried to battle Siddharth's illness, they had lost the battle in 1997 when he had died by suicide and also emphasized that he still has a pang of guilt for the same. In the end, I lost, he chose to go, Kabir added.